I finally found a place I can sit without getting smoke in the face. Greetings one and all, how's everyone doing? I hope very well. I'm out here doing another pie iron cooking. I'm going to be doing a Cubano, or actually a couple of Cubanos. And uh, I want to say right out the bat that um, I have the wrong bread for this. Because I my original plan was just to come out and do turkey, ham, and cheese. But I was thinking, man, a Cubano sounds really good. So I already had bread at home. I went ahead and brought it with me. It's uh, Dave's Killer Bread, the white bread that they make. Excuse me, which is really good. <clears throat> and uh, so, totally wrong bread, but I got the rest of the ingredients. It's, it's pork, it's ham, it's Swiss, mustard, and pickle. And it's actually a pressed sandwich, so I think it would be really well, I think it would do well in the pie iron because it's already a pressed sandwich and that's what the pie iron does. So. Also, I haven't been making uh, as many pie iron video because uh, the three ideas I had to do for pie iron cooking was um, they were all desserts, but I'm, I'm trying not to eat that stuff anymore because I'm not getting any healthier and I'm not getting any younger. So, so that's why I've been like kind of stumped on ideas for what to make. So, you know, it's going to be meat and cheese. And I don't, you know, I, I hate to just keep doing meat and cheese, but. I really like Cubanos, so if you've ever had a Cubano, a, a real one, you, know, you know how good they are. They're, they're a really good sandwich. So, we're going to do that, and I was basically watching a clip from the, the movie Chef from 2014. Really good movie, you should check it out, and uh, they make Cubanos, and man, they look so good. Oh, mm. looking forward to this one. So I got one set of pie irons today, so I'm going to be you know, basically cook one and eat while the other cooking and so let's get to it all right so I run into a bit of a problem the pickles I bought are not dill pickles but they're sweet pickles so I didn't read the jar carefully I just grabbed it that was really dumb because I don't really like sweet pickles even though I like sweet things I'm going to be careful because uh, the, the whole piece of bread isn't going to fit in the pie iron. So, there's the cheese. It's not all going to fit. And the pork I have, it's just a uh, store bought. What basically happened is I changed my mind when I got to the store. I picked the wrong, worst spot today because there's just so much traffic. I'm like really close to the road, so I constantly have to keep stopping to wait for cars to drive by. And it's already a busy area as it is, so. Put that across. Put 
that over. I'm going to put ghee on it before it goes into pie irons. And you'll get one of the pie irons. The pork tastes surprisingly good. I really wish I had a proper bread for this, but... Yeah, it is what it is. I didn't lose much meat or cheese. <clears throat> I'm gonna butter this side. really thick. The only thing I don't like about these uh, little grills is because the legs and there's a little bunch of rocks in a fire which I should have pulled out and I didn't so it's hard to get a good flat making sure to uh, flip them over periodically for even cooking. I don't know if you can hear that out of the wind noise, but there's definitely some sizzle going on. That grill stand is not cooperating today. It's all the crap underneath it. So, what are you going to do? Alright, let's give this let's give this a check because I don't wanna burn the crap out of it. That's that eats. Not hardly brown at all, so More brown on the bottom side, so. I'll give that just a few and then I'll pull it. All right, let's give it a look. Mm. 
to go. Didn't lose a whole lot of cheese either. Nice. Didn't lose a whole lot of cheese either. Nice. <clears throat> mm. Well, we'll say this the, uh, Sweet pickle? No. That pork is surprisingly good though. Perhaps technically it's not the right pork either, but it does taste pretty good though. So if you have any uh, high iron suggestions, no. comment below and let me know what you think. Stuff you want to see me try or I don't mind experimenting a little bit. I mean, like I said, I'm trying to get away from the sweets and stuff, but... If you have suggestions for things you want to see me make... Let me know. So with that, as always, I appreciate you watching. And we'll catch you on the next one.